Hey, what's going on guys and girls? Old Colleague Phoenix here and welcome to episode number 5 of my Generation Zero Let's Play series. Something above me up there. So, it has occurred to me, thanks to a couple of comments on the channel, that I missed a goddamn rocket launcher uh, last episode in the gas that we went into. Oh god, I can just... no, no. Alright, we'll just go out the proper way then. Yeah, so we completely missed the rocket launcher, and I'm gonna head back there and get it. That's my plan anyway. It was sitting on the table inside the gassy bunker. And I know it's there now, so we're gonna go resolve that issue real quick. Sorry for the lack of videos, um, everybody. My brain has just been constantly, it's gotten a couple migraines over the last few days, and my vision has not been great. So I have not wanted to stare at a computer screen for extended periods of time if I could help it, because it was only making it worse. I'm a person who has perfect 2020 vision, but I'm starting to wonder whether I need glasses for some other reason. I think there's, there's a focus problem that I've got, and I used to have glasses that I'd wear when I'd play games. Um, just specifically games. But they ended up breaking and I never got new glasses to replace those. And that was a couple years ago now, so I think it's at the point now where my eyes are getting pretty pissed that I don't use them. So I need to get that sorted out sometime. Frickin' landmine. another gun. I'm going to be encumbered soon. So, there was, there's a couple mods for this game that I was interested in trying to get. Uh, they were an encumbrance mod, so I don't have to worry about ever being encumbered, which means I could fast travel even if I am, all that kind of stuff, right? Because I feel like encumbrance when you're solo really does not matter, because like multiplayer you'd share the amount of things you'd have, right? So it all works out better. When you're solo, you can get encumbered pretty quick. So I was pretty tempted to get that mod, and there was another one. But I can't think of what it was. But the issue with that is, because I'm playing this on the Game Pass, the folders that they put the Game Pass in are, like, admin locked, which you can get into, but modding stuff is a real pain in the dick. So now, if I had the Steam version, it would be infinitely easier. My only concern is, and I haven't looked this up to see if it's a thing I could do, is could I transfer my saves from the Game Pass version to the Steam version? Now that all is a question of whether I can access the folders that I need to access easily on my computer. Um, so I'll have to see if that's a thing. Otherwise, we're going to have to play this game with no mods. And the encumbrance mod looked like something that would just be like quality of life for someone playing solo it seemed not like a necessity but almost a necessity it'd be a hell of a nice thing to have right at the very least i'm gonna go through here so did we check that out I can't remember whether we actually went through this area or not. We went around. I don't know whether we ran past this barn or not last episode. I think we did. Oh, down there. What it looks like from here anyway, is it just like the just like a little bit of water? That's just a little bit of water with its reflections. There's a mission here. So no, I don't think we came here because we could have just gone straight here. Son of a bitch. Oh. Have a look. The dominator of Vizazun is out there. Dominator of Vestland. Is that a big boy?
probably not a good idea to attack it, is it? As tempted as I am to give him a whirl. Oh. That guy, I'm pretty, like, I'm pretty sure he tells everything in the immediate area where I am. Oh, you're just a, you're just a normal, you're just a hunter boy. I'm gonna eat it for a sec, I'm just gonna keep hitting him in the face. Oh! I shot the wrong one. Ow! Okay, he's dead. I think it's... They're, they're kind of just stuck in place. She's fine with me. Wolf A4, A, A, whatever it was, was destroyed by a player. Okay, interesting. I thought it was going to be like a really big boy, but this wasn't so bad. I get bullet resistant shoes for killing him? Nice. Good little schematic there. I'm okay with that. Alright, that wasn't so bad. They, they were kind of like just stuck in place. I don't think that was an intentional thing, but... From where we shot them from, they didn't really move, which worked out amazing for us. Honestly. Okay, I'm pretty glad this is here. Weapons. Mm. There really needs to be sorting categories for weight and stuff. In my opinion, there's no reason to not do that. What, atta what attachments do I have on this? Oh. Okay, yeah, that is clearer. I remember someone also said about using the green one of that. I mean, it is a lower powered scope though, so... I'll probably still sometimes use the four to eight times, because it's a higher powered scope, but... Oh, shit. Simple first aid kits. There were clearly people that were living here. Like, quite a few were staying here, all next to each other, all bundled up. If you hear this out there, know that you're not alone. There are more of us. We're holed up in a safe house at a farm near Dudix Ud de Pier for now. It's easy to barricade. We have a few guns and some food, but not much. Maybe it's isolated enough so those things won't find us right away. We're not sticking around long, though. We're looking for a way out of here by boat. Join us there. Strength in numbers. Roland, Anita, Doris, Justabion, and Stina. Okay. Looking for a way out by boat. Emergency flare, windbreaker, performance ja or performance shades. Imagine going into like your local Kmart or whatever you have in America, like a Walmart, and them just being like, these are performance shades. Why is this shit on fire? What's going on here? Man, that sounds actually really good. But the sound of that, with the wind blowing the fire, is actually really good. Even though it says it's on fire, but I don't see any fire. Ah! Oh, it's on the roof.
Yeah, no, the sound sound design for that is really good, actually. Whoa! Our shit be burning back there. Alright, how close are we to this bunker? Oh, we've gone fucking... Oh, my God. We went past it. It's over there. So, no, we did not come here because we didn't go up this far. It's what you get for not paying attention to the goddamn map, Luke. You dick. That's okay. We can run back this way and go to the bunker. Be pretty straightforward and easy. Well, we took out one of the machines. Now we know that the machines, at least in this area, if they're named, they're a hunter machine. Not anything more extreme than that. Which is good to know. Yeah, so if someone has a way that I can easily add mods to the Xbox Game Pass version, let me know. But I highly doubt it's going to be a thing that's very easy to do. Um, I know Microsoft want to change it. But the te they're in testing phases for the change that they need to make that would allow that. Um, to have the games go to whatever folder you want instead of defaulting to, like, the Windows Apps folder. Oh. What? Teleport me forward, you prick. Oh, god damn it. What's the point of that? I guess you could use a boat or something to get there. I don't know. Right, let's just go in the normal way. Then we just have to find the gas room again. Get our rocket launcher. Hopefully it's not... Oh, God, that hurt. Hopefully it's not too terribly heavy. Oh, no power, so I can't go in this way. What? Which way did I go in? This one? Yeah. I hear water sounds when I ran through that entrance then. Did you hear that too? It's like I was underwater. <laughs> Like the water's clipping in through the ground and it's giving me the water effect or something. It's strange. It said power to the right. Does that mean down and to the right? I don't think I ever fully cleared this place. Oh no, I did do the power on this. What happened? I remember doing the power on this, so why is it not activated? It deactivated itself after a certain amount of time. That's very strange. Alright, where's gas room? It's this way somewhere, I think. an exit. I hear the gas. It's in there. Profile. Eyewear. Gas mask. Okay. Alright, now it's on the table. There we go. Nice. Um. Okay, I'm encumbered. I'm gonna grab that anyway. Okay, how much does this rocket launch away? It's probably going to be a bit, yeah? Two. Oh, that's not so bad. We're only over by a little bit. Um, where's those tanks? Still over by a little bit. Okay. We're under. We're just under. 
So yeah, I really would love to get that mod, so I don't have to worry about doing that type of crap. I know, I know it's part of the game, but it would be nicer to not have to worry about that. Alright, we can go out this way. It's the way I tr No, this is not the way I tried to come in. Okay. So we got a beacon out there, we got... Ulven. Another beast. Now unbearable. Alrighty. I actually should be able to fast travel to that. E. Now, I don't believe I have any ammo for this, but it's it's awesome to have. I'm gonna put this away because I'm not using it right now. I'm sick of carrying stuff that I'm not using on a frequent basis. Mm hmm. I don't even know what that's for. Hmm. That... I probably should have signed to a slot. In case I need it. Uh, you can only sign it to slot one or two and that's it. Oh, interesting. Okay, well, if we get in a desperate situation, I guess I'll have to do that. But for now, let's not worry about it too terribly much. Uh, so we got another beast out here that we could try and kill. What are we doing weight-wise? 52. Need another skill point so I can get the... Where the hell is it? I need to get the carry capacity. So there was a mod that added, like, you get two or three skill points per... ...and stuff, which I thought was a nice little touch as well. That could have been a lot more helpful. <clears throat> Running out in this open field's a bit sketch. We need a spot where we can look at this guy and have cover to duck behind. We got lucky that they didn't push us the first time. Of course it's a flying asshole. Two of them. We need to move back. Okay, you've got a bit more movement in you. Oh, shit! No, 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 no. Why is there always two of you assholes? Okay, you're, you're causing problems for me. Oh my god. Why are you guys here? Ow, ow. Holy shit. 
That hurt a lot. Freaking hell, dude. It's never just one, man. It's never just one. Hollow point ammo. Give me another schematic. Plastic and armor piercing rounds. Nah. Alright, well, we got it killed, nonetheless. Not in the manner of which I would have liked. That was more stressful than what I was thinking it was going to be. But it, it's dead now. And relatively easily. We did get pretty low on health there for a minute. It got a little bit sketchy towards the end there. Not going to lie. But we succeeded nonetheless. Uh, not too far. Hopefully there'll be a safe housey thing there. In this town, I hope. So the hunters aren't too bad. Not great if you have more than one of them, though. Makes it a little bit difficult, and I can hear a flying asshole again. If he could just go away, that'd be sweet. Do I run faster than pistol out? I don't think so. I don't think that matters. I've also still got the gas mask on, which I'm going to take off because... We're going to wear some performance shades. that make everything like a slightly different color? What the frick? Oh. Now you see that? That I think is a tank. It's dead. But that is a tank. And usually when things are called tanks, they're a bit bullet spongy. So that's great. We're probably going to run into those over here. Which is just fantastic. I hear things. Oh, crap. Bloody hell are those? Oh shit. Ow, 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 Ah! Ah! Ow! Fuck off out of here! Okay, you know what? Ray, you big fuck. Okay, that worked out alright. We are able to get up and above him. Fucked him from above. 
Right, Christ. I didn't expect it to be so full on immediately. I know we'd have probably a couple enemies, but I don't know. Another field radio? and nah. Another assault rifle. I hear things over there. Freaking out. Wow, 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 wow. Unbarrel lightness. Get to the radio mast. Da 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 da. Okay, so this is a camp. This is not a base of operations, though, that I wanted. There's another one. Another assault rifle. Starting to lean towards that we're going to need an assault rifle, eh? They're going to keep giving them to us. Like, it feels almost like they're saying, yeah, you need, you need it. Uh, so we need to go this way. No, this way. Yeah, this way. Alright, fantastic. That's towards where the tank was dead off the bridge. There's Vern Bunker. Oh, there's a bunker right here, isn't there? Is there a way in, though? I do not know where the entrance is. I assume it's here somewhere if it's telling me about the bunker when I'm standing there. No. Mm. Not that I'm super worried about it. Yeah, no, okay. We're not, we're not going to worry about it right now. Alright, this is uncharted territory where there's probably going to be way worse things than what we've dealt with. Oh, it might be there. It looks like it's probably the bunker entrance. If I was to take a guess. It sounds like it's got a gas leak as well. Yeah, we're not going to worry about this right now. I say we come back for that. Just this time. I mean, it probably has like a... Oh, no, it probably wouldn't have a base thing in it because, like, it's literally covered in gas. I'd rather try and get down to our next mission point if we can... And hope that there's a spot, a saving spot down here somewhere. Hmm. <clears throat> Seems all relaxed out here on a beautiful stroll in the afternoon or morning. I don't, I don't know what it is in this game anymore. I can't remember. I think it's morning because I think last episode it was dark basically the entire time. Well, that sounds big. Right. Great, 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 great. Very good, very good. Yes, yes, yes. Very good, great. Let's see if we can avoid them. 
I don't want to fight absolutely everything. See if we can get around them. What always worries me is when you don't clear things out, I feel like it, if you get something further down the line, it attracts them across as well. Alright, there's a house down here. It's got runners all down there, though. And a flying boy from the sounds of it. Which means if we fight them, that hunter comes down from that hill and we have to fight him. Pretty much 100% guaranteed. I think. Let's see if we can get over to the, to the, the main mission first, maybe? Let's see how we go with that. Hopefully we can just, like, cut straight through between our, all the shit and, and get over here unscathed. Maybe. Locate and unlock the farmlands command bunker code named Sorkin. Destroy enough machines in the farmlands region to get a complete entry code. Oh, fucking great. Well, can you not run towards me? You were not a normal runner, were you? What the hell were you? Haha! Uh -huh. You got stuck on the chair! So I need it for this, I assume. Have a look. One of the soldiers in the dispatch team started writing this, but they didn't get to finish. Removing the machine only cleared the disturbance for a few seconds, then it returned. It may be covered by other masks. We'd require intervention teams to be deployed on all the other masks and clear them, but with our comms crippled, it's near impossible. Sounds horrible. Don't do that. It's fucking terrible to listen to. Um. Oh my god. Level up again. Okay. Well, shit. It doesn't have me have a main mission. What? Excuse me, game? Uh, locate the ruins of the castle. Destroy enough machines to... Get a complete barcode. Where the hell is that supposed to be? Where is that bunker? Ah. Let's 
Sorkin Bunker. Where the fuck is Sorkin Bunker? Is it over here? Go over this way. Is it this thing? Oh, it looks like a normal house. Looks like they were moving out, potentially, or they own musical instruments. I hear things. Where? Oh, there. Is that a normal hunter? That looks bigger. That looks considerably bigger, actually. Hmm. Where is he? Yeah, that looks bigger than a normal hunter, man. Look at the size of the gun on the side. I want to look at the front of him. Come on, fucker. Turn around. It doesn't look like a normal hunter to me, chief. Can I? Can I? I got it. I have to jump and smash E at the same time. Keep an eye on it. Okay, I want to quickly look at my log. Oh, I'm gonna have to. God. I'm gonna have to go find all these bunkers and do all that, aren't I? Okay, well... What is this one? Locate the ruins of the castle. Oh, interesting. That's, that goes backwards. Uh-huh. Okay. I'm okay with that. We get to go back. Back to the base or the church. We'll miss the church. Alright, so this is the castle. That thing looks whack. That thing looks n not normal. Okay. Well, anyway, guys and girls, I guess that is going to be the end of this episode. Next episode, we're going to be heading over to that castle and seeing what the hell is going on over there. See what that's all about. But if you liked the video, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more Generation Zero in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. All right, peace!